guys any good? This one so it says pepper. That's the rational mouse. No, it's a mouse. Pepper. Pepper's adventure. So he has an adventure in this book. Pepper's adventure. One day, Dad came home with two pet mice in a little cage. Sarah loved them. She called the brown one pepper and the white one salt. Salt. Yeah. So the white one you can really see here a little that salt can't see him much. Her much. And then it's a girl. Here's Pepper Beller. It's a better pepper over there. Dad made a big new cage for pepper and salt. It had a wheel and a ladder and a room. Oops. Upstairs. Sarah played with the mice a lot and so did Nick. So Nikki. this is Nick. Nikki. 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 So this is Nikki. And so did Nikki for from next door. Don't take them outside, said mom. But one day, Nikki did take Pepper outside. No, don't do that, said Sarah. Bring Pepper back inside. But Nikki put Pepper down on the grass to see if he liked it and Pepper ran away. He ran into the flowers, flower bed. He ran into the flower bed. I'm sorry, said Nikki. Nikki was sorry. But that did not bring Pepper back. Pepper had gone. There are lots of hiding places in the garden for a little brown mouse. The children looked for Pepper, but they did not find him. A cat may get him and eat him up, said Sarah. Nikki went home crying. Let's put Pepper's little cage out in the garden, said Mom. Maybe he will want to go back inside his old room. Sarah put some food in the cage. Pepper will be hungry, said she said. Mom and Sarah put the cage down by uh, the flowers. They opened the door, but Pepper did not come. 
they had to go back to the house without him. Sarah went to tell Sauce, Pepper has gone, she said, but at bedtime they looked again and there sitting inside his old cage was Pepper. Salt will be pleased, said Sarah, and Salt was.